It all started from boats. I'm Eric Gertz, and we're here at Gertz Composites. In 1975, I started Eric Gertz Custom Sailboats Incorporated. And we built 10 America's Cup boats, including one that's on display at the Harrisoft Museum at the other end of Bristol. 207, 208, 209, the whole world blows up and nobody's buying any of these boats anymore. So we took a nosedive, I mean, we crashed. And coming out of that, we started Gertz Composites. You might think of composites starting out early on in uh, fiberglass, but it's evolved into carbon fiber and beyond. We also do a lot with uh, education and training and workforce development to make sure there's a skilled labor force. There's companies that have uh, amazing expertise in working with these materials. So they've really taken that uh, in expertise and that interest and really have started to say, how can we get into some of these new markets? Blue economy is really an evolving sector. We're looking at infrastructure projects, theme park projects, military projects. We're looking at architectural projects. These are all areas that were never really touched by composites until very recently. Rhode Island has always had a really strong manufacturing base, from Slater Mill to the Harrisoff Manufacturing Company, right through to today. We're just another part of that continuum. 